Well, God sent a pillar of fire for a member and a column of, uh, in, 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 in the days of Egypt and uh, with, uh, of course, Moses was uh, at the Red Sea and uh, was going to cross there and Pharaoh and his army wanted to destroy and uh, the Israelites must have been I forget the number of them now so many over the age of 21 and under the age of 55 Uh, which was, of course, the time allowed for men to go to war. Um, it's like a cross in the sky there. It's beautiful. I've never seen a cross before in the sky. And down the bottom here is another one of those... Um, Font of Morgana, Morgana or something, Mirage, which is beautiful. What do they call that name? It's like a mirage. So you've got a sun below that, and above it, uh, the reflection. Beautiful. Of course, I filmed um, a Mirage Double Sun not long ago. That is beautiful. Christ died for our sins, the just, the just for the unjust. Being put to death in the flesh, but quickened by the Spirit. Christ died for us according to the scriptures. As the Old Testament said that in Psalm 22 it says, All they that see me laugh me to scorn, shoot up the lip and shake the head, saying, He trusted on the Lord uh, that he would deliver him, let him deliver him, seeing he delighted in him, which is a Amazing, because when Jesus was on the cross, they repeated those words, saying, if you're the Christ, come down. We believe in you. Of course, uh, uh, Jesus um, died on the cross for the sins of the whole world, suffered in our place. Took on himself the blo those blows which would do against us for all eternity to spend in hell. And uh, Jesus became uh, our sin bearer. And uh, it was predicted in the Old Testament that by his stripes we are healed or we like sheep have gone astray we have gone and turned everyone to his own way and the Lord hath laid on him the iniquity of us all that was Isaiah chapter I think it's 55 or 53 53 He made his grave uh, with the wicked and with the rich in his death, it says there. Uh, not when Jesus died on a cross amongst sinners, thieves, uh, murderers. He died, made his grave with the wicked and with the rich in his death. Because, was it Joseph of Aramatha? Aramatha? Aramathia. Carried his uh, body down and of course he had the robe of a rich man put on him 
They crowned him king, of course, and wrote King of Kings, King of the Jews, in Greek, Hebrew and Latin. It's a lovely sunset here if you want to come and watch. Beautiful. It's just about finished now. Christ Jesus came into the world to save sinners. Being put to death in the flesh, but quickened by the Spirit. The blood of Jesus Christ, God's Son, cleanseth us from all sin. So there is hope. Hope thou in God, says the psalmist. It says in, uh, I think it's verse 16 of Psalm 22. It says, they uh, pierced my hands, pierced my hands and feet. And then it says, they um, cast lots, lots on his vesture and of course they cast lots the Romans according to the prophecy predicted in the time of David. David was carried by the spirit beyond himself. He wasn't talking of himself because David never at any point had his hands and feet pierced. On one occasion David had the sword cling to his hand because he had so much blood spilled from the enemies never his hands and feet pierced. That was a prophecy of Jesus where he was taken beyond himself and predicted the Christ who was to come, the Mashiach, the anointed Messiah. Oh, yes, yes. The Torah, HaTorah, Moshe. Yashin Miru Hatora Bayad Moshe. I found the book of the Law of Lord written by the hand of Moses. And uh, they found it in the temple temple in the days of Josiah. The original scriptures written by Moses, which were kept in the Ark of the Covenant. And the copy of that has been passed down to us. And we have an inspired and infallible truth given to us all, which shows that in the prophecies that Christ was to die, the just for the unjust. And all who live and believe on Jesus will have eternal life. But the wicked and unbelieving shall perish. Repent and believe today.